Hope you had a chance to enjoy the dry weather we had early in the day because rain showers are now going to be with us the majority of the evening. And our Fifth Third Bank camera downtown Toledo is going to carry that gloomy feel across our Toledo skyline. We have 37 degrees across the area, and so far this winter season, yeah, snowfall has definitely been missing. We are now over a foot below normal in snowfall. We've only recorded 1.6 inches of snowfall with the rain that is falling right now. Even our precipitation for the winter season is well below average. Now an inch of a deficit that is developed uh, with respect to rainfall as well. We do have rain that's occurring right now from Fremont that extends over toward Clyde down to Green Springs and rain that's back over toward Gibsonburg and Woodville and up into Oak Harbor and some steady showers that are with us yeah, across the Toledo Metro right in time for that evening drive. We're looking at some steady rain from Toledo down through Oregon over toward Walbridge back over toward Perrysburg into Monclova and some steady rain that extends from Holland up to Sylvania where wet weather is certainly going to be with us the next several hours. We've got rain from Fayette down to Archbold. Steady showers back toward West Unity over toward Stryker and into Montpelier. You're also in the midst of some steady soaking rain that is occurring. So if you peek out your own window and several of the views that we have across Northwest Ohio from Perrysburg to Sylvania, we do have wet roads that are going to be with us down toward Waterville and Bowling Green. That gives us a very good vantage point of I-75 and just south of there toward Finley. We've got widespread wet weather and rain that is occurring. So the rain's going to be with us the next several hours. Steady or soaking rain showers should amount to about a quarter of an inch of total rainfall just in the next few hours. But in tomorrow morning, we're going to get a break in that activity. Showers are going to taper off overnight and we're going to get a little sliver of sunshine first thing in the morning and it will be very mild, almost spring feeling tomorrow morning, right around 50 degrees to start the day. That'll be the warmest point of the day, uh, mid to late morning as we still tap into some of that sunshine through about mid morning. Once the clouds return, that breeze will turn cooler and perhaps as early as lunchtime, we begin to drop back off breezy and cooler for the afternoon. So the warmest point of the day, We'll be headed out the door in the morning, upper 40s to near 50 degrees. And by late afternoon, we'll be dropping back into the lower 40s. So there's the mild feel first thing in the morning. And again, some peaks of sunshine going to be with us through mid to late morning. The high of the day right around or just before lunchtime. Then we drop off into the afternoon and we begin to turn cooler as we fall through the 40s. Still going to be a very mild day. A sprinkler or two going to be possible tomorrow, but largely it will be a dry day Tuesday. Lower 40s into Wednesday, dry conditions Wednesday. Then rain chances return back into the area for Thursday. I do expect that's most likely for the morning hours will be dry for much of Thursday afternoon and highs in a few areas, especially south of Toledo. Thursday could make it to 50 or warmer. We turn a little cooler into the weekend. Friday, Saturday and Sunday will settle back right around the upper 30s into Monday. Rain snow mix does not appear to be a major storm at this point and we'll stay right around the upper 30s into Monday and Tuesday. This 10 day forecast now gets us well into the second half of January and we still don't see any major winter storms on the horizon. So that snowfall deficit will continue to grow as we go through the coming days. We are seeing more 30s in the forecast this week, but these spring like days really feel spring like with the warmer feel and the rain. Wait till tomorrow morning and don't be fooled by it because the nicest point tomorrow is going to be in the morning and then it will turn cloudy and cooler through the afternoon. Uh, it'll have a spring feel tomorrow morning with many areas close to 50 degrees. Wow. All right.